Good, hello, welcome back to Feature Nuggets. Uh, this is a bit of a two-parter, quite important that you check out the previous one if you haven't, about auto patches. So to set this thing up so that it automatically connects all the fills. Auto patches inside the upper arm. If I turn that on, you'll see that it's just that on its own. I'm gonna reorder its thread to go above the lower arm. Now you can see it sort of creates the illusion like they're connected. So now if I get a line art node and have a second instance, but this one goes behind all of the other parts, there we go. It's now created what appears to be a seamless juncture. No matter where I move or bend this arm, it's gonna look like one shape. So it's pretty cool, isn't it? It's actually a really simple build. It does have one drawback, and that is it doesn't know where to end. And more often than not, you would want some sort of limit where a crease in this arm, for example, would start to appear. So I'm gonna show you how to do that in the next nugget. And before we close off this one, to reiterate why the auto patch is important, I'm gonna swap it out for a color art and you can see what the difference is. See that? By just having the color art slapped on top of everything else, it's, it's too big and it eats away from the line art and this looks lousy.